Hello everyone, it's been a while and welcome back to another trail reaction featuring the best boys Get Silius and Sif Scott. Hello! And this time around, we're excited to react to one of the games that we have talked non-stop about, at least if you've been a fan of the channel. Scott and I are a huge fan of RPGs, we're a huge fan of Falcom RPGs particularly, and we also are, I, I would say, the Grand Blue Fantasy we like fanboys. Uh, if it wasn't for us, it would be the million sales, so thank us yep. for that million. <laughs> Yep, the game's merits have no merit. It's just us. <laughs> it's just us. It's literally us. It's been us the whole time, every time. But unironically, <laughs> check out that game. But the game we've been looking forward to from Falcom is Yeast 10, which I believe is Yeast Nordics. Yeast X, so Yeast yep. Nordics. And I'm a huge fan of the Yeast series. And my favorite is Yeast Origin. I think it's just like a good game. I also enjoyed uh, Yeast 7. So those are like my top two. There's a couple I enjoy, but. Well, let's get into this trailer and let's see what it's about. And be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. So be notified next time I go live with more gaming trailer reaction and other cool content. Do it. Do it. All right. So uh, you're on a surfboard. I'm very proud of that. That's great. It looks, honestly, it looks really good. I'm not going to deny it. It's <laughs> really good. Oh, yeah. It looks really nice. You can swing like Spider-Man. I think that's a really cool thing. I want to rewind that back. He's like, he, like, we, who needs J. Jonah James to get for Spider-Man? Get the pieces of Adam. Adam <laughs> oh, in the sky. Adam in the sky, yeah. So this time around, so we, I think we did, we did a, a reaction to the gameplay trailer from, I believe it was Tokyo Game Fest. It was one of the gaming fests, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. You can always check the video correct or something. And they mentioned that this game, that will have two playable characters. It'll be Adol with his amnesia brain not happening. And then a new character, which I believe is the uh, pirate, a pirate, right? Well, I don't know her whole shtick, but it, her name is Karja. So. Yeah, they said she was a pirate. <laughs> according, according, they, they, they said she's a pirate. Oh, which, you got the press release. Is that what you're saying? No. <laughs> I'm saying that I did my due diligence to support the Falcom gaming industry because someone has to. Because someone has to actually know the difference between Kusuko no Kiki and Kusuko no Kikuri Black, all right? Which I don't know how to pronounce any of that, but I do know one of them is the better game. <laughs> They're both good games. <laughs> oh god! But unironically, um, this looks really good. Um, oh, we got use next Nice. Neat. Yeah, the animations look much cleaner than uh, East Nine. Yeah. So we had this for. Uh, oh god! Wait, wait, wait! It's coming fall this year. Hype, really pog off. So. Heck yeah! Oh wait, that means we're getting a Trails game and an East game in the same year. Yeah, they finally doing it. <laughs> Stepping up. Hi. Throw your hands up. We're so proud. So happy. Um, so it's coming off for Nintendo, Sony, and PC. Um, so shout outs to NIS for continuing and Falcom in general doing the PC thing. Um, I remember there was an interview a while back that the i believe one of the ceos directors of falcom was really excited of the sales for the west for all their games and i think most of the sales came from sony ish but mostly pc as well yep yeah so put more games on pc if you can third party people just do it and like there is an audience for you out there you'd be surprised yep you just have to make it also make it be as good as so the japanese release of east 10 has a lot of extra features on the PC one. Like it has ultra ride support, it has Steam Deck support. Oh, so God. I just hope that the one that we're getting is gonna be similar to that in the oh, West. God. Yeah. <laughs> God, I don't wanna get gimped out. I don't wanna get gimped out. That would be pretty terrible. <laughs> yeah. Give and us I'll... all the best ones. Yeah, like keep it like keep the same price. And like on ironically, I mean this okay, so let's just say the the Japanese and the global release comes out in fall. And the first month of fall is, I believe, September, right? So let's say it comes in September. But, and let's say in September they launch like a, a, a some DLC, you know, quality like patches, but like, let's say some DLC, right? Yep. I would be happy. This is, I would gladly wait a month, even two months maximum, if they launch the game, right? And it's a complete version for the PC. Heck yes. I would take that as a, as a wait as well. I would gladly wait for that because I, I would like to play. I'm not saying I want a superior virtual PC. I just want an equal and fair quality of a game that I enjoy 
on the console for PC if you're going to port it for PC. Yes. If you're not going to port it to PC, that's fine. Just do not make a gimped PSP. <laughs> Give us the best part version. Yeah, please do. It seems like though from the trailer, the uh, both uh, Adol and his amnesia is fighting. He's gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> One of these days, he won't have amnesia, right? Oh, right. God. <laughs> oh my god. It, it's 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 just super interesting how this this character has been in like ten plus games and he's lost his memory. But God, like <laughs> God, this is so, so graphically impressive compared to last year. I'm so impressed. <clears throat> Yeah, they they look like they're doing a lot of good things on this game. Yeah, the one thing I, I want to see though is I would say this is more like this is more cutscene. I want to see more action gameplay, like how the character moves around and stuff. But that's about it. But this is a really good announcement for you. If you're on the fence for a good ARPG and somehow are not playing Grand Blue Fantasy really, uh, this is up your alley. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this, this is there too. <laughs> this is there too. Yeah, and obviously you have to play Final Fantasy Rebirth. I mean. Square Enix needs the money. They're a small indie company. You know how they are. Zach Fair needs the support to stay mainstream. Zach Fair needs the support. <laughs> but no, I, I'm super excited for this game. I'm looking forward to the next trailer. They have more, maybe like a more timeline what happens, or more timeline or story content what happens. But I'm also digging um, Adol's new 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 look. He, he looks a little more clean, you know. Yeah, he looks a lot cleaner, and it, which is great. I mean, it's not like East Nine and Ease like looked bad or anything. It's just this, this. This looks much better. <laughs> yeah, like I'm always good, always happy for improvements. But with that out the way, that's all I have to say about this game. I'm looking forward to that coming out fall 2024 for Sony, Nintendo, and PC. You stuff? I'm really looking forward, and I do. I wonder how like the gameplay differs when you're playing as Abel or Karja, and to see like ha if there is like a big difference in play style. And I do appreciate that. There is so much content that we can see just from this trailer of the ship battles, of the swinging on the vines, of the running from fire, you know, all the best parts. All the best parts. Yeah, and getting pictures of Spider-Man. <laughs> yeah, oh man. One one thing I also am hoping for is that, I know they haven't done this or it has been a haven't done this, if this has co-op gameplay, I would Ooh. be so happy. So if, if that would that be happens, great. That would be great. That is a dream. If it happens, I'll be super happy. If not, I'm still going to be happy with it. But Qualk Gameplay will put it over the top for me. Yes. Now move from a buy to must buy. <laughs> buy to pre buy. Yes. Yeah, to pre buy. Yep. Anyway, <laughs> thank you guys for so much for checking out our reaction to the Yeast, uh, yeast, uh, the yeast 10 or Yeast X Nordics. Um, this game looks pretty dope. If you have any opinions about it, let us know in the comments below. With that, we'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.